Okay, today we're going to do a couple of remainder type problems that are common on UIL number sense. Number 17 is one of them, and also number 34, another remainder problem within the same test. Um, 34 plus 65 plus 96 divided by 3 has remainder of blank. Well, instead of adding those and dividing by 3, what we're going to do is divide each by 3 and find the remainder of each and then add the remainders. 34 divided by 3 has a remainder of 1. 65 divided by 3 has a remainder of 2. And 96 is a multiple of 3. So if we add 1 plus 2 plus 0, that's 3 divided by 3. Remainder is 0. And of course you could add some of the digits. 9 plus 6 is 15. 15 is a multiple of 3, so that's 0. And then you can cast out factors of 3 throughout the 6. 5 minus 3 is 2. And 3, you can cast out the 3. That's a factor of 3. And then 4 divided by 3 is 1. The remainder winds up being 0. Uh, what about dividing by 5 on number 34? It says 4 to the 4th power plus 3 cubed times 2 squared. Well, we're not going to calculate all of those. All we're going to do is find the remainder for each one of those. And then multiply or divide the remainders. 2 squared is 4, divided by 5 has a remainder of 4. 3 squared is 27, divided by 5 has a remainder of 2. We're going to multiply those two. So 2 times 4 is 8, and 8 divided by 5 is, is a remainder of 3. So we have a plus 3 here. And then 4 to the 4th, 4 squared is 16, and 4 to the 4th would be 4 squared squared. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take 4 squared is 16 divided by 5 is remainder 1, and then square the remainder, so that would be just 1. 1 squared is 1. So I have 1 plus 3, that's 4, so the remainder should be 4. And so this concludes our short video on remainder problems.